Okay, so this DVD. DVD. So if you pop the DVD into the DVD player slot, basically it's all kind of like weird, sort of black and white, like sketchy footage of the security camera stuff. And it's like a highlight reel of all of the different people that Austin's murdered. Mm. Ooh. You see, like, Austin with the katana beheading somebody. You see him with, like, taking the pedestal and, like, bashing somebody's brains in. Ooh. You know, you don't ever see any of him actually making his escape, though. And then, at the end of the DVD, there is the number 50. So I've got four uh, numbers. Is the Big Bear Will logo after the, <laughs> the edited? Okay. Clearly not a good highlight reel, then. Wait, not, Austin. It's like, I'm the one who brought you all here. Yeah. Check out the best of the film in theory in Brasovia. <laughs> yes. What What was, Story when you got all the clues, three. how did you get out? Yeah. Like, yeah, what so happened? Did it just open up a yeah. door, or? I get out. No, I, like, how? Like, physically, how do you get out? I go downstairs. Oh, like a door opens up. No. I, I break through. Right. Breaks through, through what? The floor. Does, does the position change? Yes. Okay. Oh. Okay, so we've got 38, 50, 7, and 12. Mm -hmm. Does that seem like enough numbers for this type of safe to you? It shouldn't be. The number, there should always be an odd number of numbers. That makes Here's sense. So we need more. one more. <clears throat> Minimum. 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 Sure. What, what have we not checked? Let's think positive. I... I I'm gonna at this point Travis is like Jonesin. He's Jonesin. He You're really, doing so well. He's he's like looking to start a fire just by like conduction. <laughs> <laughs> he wants to like, <coughs> like rub together materials to start a fire. I want to check the pedestal really quick. Are there any uh, like uh, remnants of like blood or viscera on the bottom of it, or where I saw Austin bashing people in with it? Gore. <laughs> it's clean. But keep yep. it clean. Did it look like the same pedestal? It does look like the same pedestal. Can, I, at least the rooms I have access to, I want to knock on the floors to see if there's any obvious, like, hollowness or anything. In all the rooms? All the rooms that I can get to, yeah. Um, there's nothing that makes, like, a hollow sound. Okay. Hmm. Wait, also, what do you, what do you break through the floor with? Lots of things. Sometimes I use the pedestal. Oh, you're strong. Oh. oh, hey, Travis, I can really see that you're suffering. So if you go back to the room where Eliza's body is, I ripped this camera out of the wall over there. So the wires are exposed. And if you use your clothing, you could probably start a fire. So if you want to go over there and get some stuff going for yourself. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> <Good luck there. laughs> Travis goes in that room. I oh, in fact, you don't even have to mess with your own clothes. Eliza's dead. She's not using her clothes anymore. So you can use hers. I guess it's not that dangerous. <laughs> Are you Travis goes into the Satan room and he shoots a camera. <laughs> Are you trying to get him to OD and then we can get another clue? No. Oh, okay. But if he kills himself by accident, well, that's on him. Well, I wonder if that counts. Wouldn't then he would get the clue? Because we wouldn't have killed him. We'll still all hear it. Well, no, but you have to ask for the clue, and so well, then you we get can, it by killing Why don't we someone. go check on him in a little bit, and if he's gone, we can ask, but it might not count if it's self -employed. That's what I'm saying. Really, it's... I'd rather have a person unconscious from heroin than jonesing and going crazy on us while we're trying to get I agree. Come at us that is again. a good idea. Okay, so you always go through the floor, Austin. Through the floor. Yes. Okay, so... But, we, well, we... We've already checked all the floors. All the floors are tile. Underneath the tarps? Yeah, what they're all tarps. Seven. Same? Yep, same. What about the hallway? Hallway is the same same material. Okay. Does the seven room also have a camera in it? It does. Oh, okay. Um, what? I, what? Let's try breaking through the, the where the, the... Satan symbol is? Not not the Satan symbol, the message one. Oh, yeah, where death is... The, a, death is the... The P room. Oh, yeah, that was the in a specific room. spot. Yeah, that was at the, on the bottom, yeah. underneath. Let's try it with the pedestal. I mean, we can all lift it up if we get around it. And yeah, I mean, it's worth a shot. 
So you're gonna lift up the pestle and drop it in that mm -hmm. floor area, mm -hmm. like a makeshift jackhammer kind of thing, yeah. You try and it like cracks, and like the deeper you go down, it just ends up being concrete. Mm. <laughs> oh. Okay. I mean, we could try this in every room. It just that'd take a, a long while. time, and I'd rather get tired. What I find sure. interesting is, I mean, I'm pretty rich. And I own a lot of property. Based on the way this is designed, if he changed the puzzle every time to create a tunnel underneath that you can escape that was different every single time, that's a major operation. You cannot just create architectural changes like that. What if it's what if we're suspended and he just rotates the whole apparatus? Hmm. We would have been able to determine that as we broke through here. No, see no, how I this mean, concrete is laid? I mean, at each, at each, oh, oh, I see what you yeah. mean. Yeah, if yeah, this yeah. was mobile, there would be a gap space. Mm -hmm. And so that's just not how design works. Like, that we would, if this entire room was a rotating room, just having broken through this title would have been able to tell us that that was how this was designed. Hmm. Shipping containers? I don't know. Oh. I guess it's different locations every time. Yeah, oh, that makes sense. Well, there's a lot of different locations. A lot of people. You know what's very interesting? None of you guys are famous or interesting at all. <laughs> and and these people on this list, also not famous or interesting. Wait. I'm the only famous person who's ever been kidnapped. Hmm. I mean, there doesn't really seem to be any correlating factor between any of the victims. Yeah, except they're all mundane. And you're the one anomaly? I'm very interesting. What is what, what? What does that mean? It's globally known. I don't know. I mean, I clearly am not the most evil. I mean, we're all a little evil. I mean, your life is so great, and you're here with us. Are you, is is uh? I want to go check. Is it. Austin in the room while you're saying this? Yeah. He's like, doesn't matter who you become; it's who you were. Hmm. Maybe I was very famous before. Which one did? I could have been a Hitler. Hmm. Uh, Hitler was terrible at his job. It's just a bunch of morons. You could like have Trump been, supporters. You could have been like a Nero. Ooh. You could have been like um, Caligula. Like a Caligula. I want to go Caligula check was on a very Travis. Good violinist. Uh, I want to check I on Travis. You hmm? checked on Travis? That was a miss. No, you're Travis, thinking of the... Uh, uh, how you doing? Yeah. Travis is passed out. He's passed out? Yeah. I, I try and shake him awake. Hey, buddy. How you doing? You there? Travis? Look. Did you kill me yet? No. <laughs> How you doing? Good. Only good? <laughs> Don't you want to be great? How can I be You great? want to make Travis great again? How? Yes. Yeah. I mean, you've still got some left there, I see. Oh. I've never been great. You can, you just, you know, but you can feel great. <laughs> Are you having him use the needle that he came with? Yeah. No, you're having to use one of the... the no, 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 one of, no, one of his. Like, does he Does he still have... Did he use all of his stuff? Uh, yeah, he used all of his stuff. Goes, he used all of it. There's none those, left. Those, those needles fall off a little bit. <laughs> Zach, uh, can you do the dirty work for us? We really need your help. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's, that's... I'm used to that. <laughs> I'm not stirring you in any No, no, I know. I, I just... I figure, luckily with those clues... If we ever hit a roadblock, you can always just ask someone. <laughs> it's awful. Before you use any of them, you know, John's idea about counting the syringes might be meaningful. Does it look like there's more than a hundred syringes? Yeah, I mean, it was a body there bag There was a body filled. bag full of Okay, because if it's more than a hundred, then it wouldn't matter because right, yeah, the number's yeah. too large. That's, it's, it's a, that's a lot. Um, are you, could... you going to kill Travis with a used syringe? No. <laughs> I'm going to leave. Okay, if he can't... If, if there's not enough for him to OD, I'm going to leave. Uh, wait a minute. Uh, the, the satanic symbol, <laughs> is it a five-pointed star? Yeah. No, actually, no. It's, um... It's not? Well, it's not like... Uh? It's not, like, I mean... I shouldn't say, like, uh... Yeah, it is. But, like... <laughs> that could be the number five. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Like, maybe that's the fifth number. So we have five, seven, twelve, thirty-eight, and fifty. Or it could be the amount of people... 
It could be how many posters are there? <laughs> yeah, there's over a hundred posters. Mean, so. We do have one limiting factor that if it's over a hundred. Oh, okay. Wait, there's more than a hundred posters. There's more than a hundred. Okay. Posters. Well then, yeah, it could be us. I'm gonna start trying safe combinations. Yeah, that five. That's that's yeah. that's reasonable. Yeah. Wait, if you're trying it with that combination, it's not gonna work. Okay. What about with eight? That's not gonna work. Well, I mean, no what, nine. What, what about awesome. every order oh, of right, the five? Nine. That could take a while. I'll just go ahead and say that the combination that includes five does not work. Okay. So five is not the number. I mean, so God hasn't talked to us in a while. We could theoretically stay in here for a very long time checking these permutations. Well, like, we Food. Could, but we could just go hungry. Like he, God yeah, probably doesn't care if we all go hungry that's and true. die. He'll just oh, find that, more people to make the best. That would happen if we don't kill anyone. Travis's injuries and wounds, do they look like he's... Do they look like just combat wounds? Like, does he have any like? They just look like like uh, like he's used drugs. Oh, like, no, 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 Austin. Oh, I'm oh, sorry. Yeah, yeah. I'm sorry, Austin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, his wounds basically look like scars, bruising. Like it looks like he's been taken care of, though. That's what I'm curious about. Does um, it look like he's been sewn up? It does look like he's been sewn up. Gosh dang it, no. Uh, <laughs> no. Hmm. No. Count That's the, your job. Count the stitches. Yeah, I can count the <laughs> stitches. The number. So, Austin. No, every number has been very obvious. Do you... Th- yeah. In any of the puzzle iterations that you ever had to escape, did you ever have to find the combination of a safe? Mm. Or something like that? No, not yet. Or a secret that was hidden inside the body of someone? Yeah, they always ask, you can kill somebody, or you can not kill somebody, and if you kill somebody, you get a clue, or you know, you get to know a secret. And I never ask for secrets, I just ask for clues. But were there ever any... I kill enough people, I get all the clues, they let me out. So you've never actually tried to... Like the first time, did you ever go, oh... I killed this person, and I found that inside his stomach was, like, a key or a number. No, I don't find things like that in people. Hmm. What was written underneath the safe? I don't find anything in people anymore. What? Oh, yeah, what was... What was written underneath the the safe? safe. I forget. I know we found it. It was a QR code. That's right, the QR code. Yeah, and then the phone. Well, that was just my guess, was maybe there's something in the safe. Yeah. Yeah, By the way, now, you were hearing before the sound of, like... People. People. Now the sound has started up again, and it's kind of like music. Hmm. Kind of sounds like dance music. Ooh, what's what time is it? You check. Well, you turn the clock back to eight. Yeah. It's now eight thirty. Okay. okay. So nine thirty. <laughs> dance music. <laughs> yeah. What kind of dance music is it? Play like EDM. Okay. Oh, interesting. Uh, oh, we're part of a, some raver's sick game. Hmm. Uh, have we overlooked anything? Well, I mean, obviously, because we can't think of this. How many like, letters I... are in the are in the phrase in the room in the P room? If I count all the letters in that in that phrase in both See, of those I, phrases, I, I don't think it's wait, anything wait, like wait, that so because in uh, the in the fr- so life is merely a yeah, tangent yeah, yeah. on the way to death. I mean, you could like count that if you want. Uh, every everything else has been a literal <laughs> uh, an number. obvious yeah. number. Uh, it's we don't have to do any ciphering. It feels like the last number should be like something like you know, kind of hidden. What about on the ceiling of the hallway? Is there anything on the ceiling of the hallway? There's nothing on any of the ceilings. Okay. Hmm. So we haven't been able to get into the safe, but there are a few things we haven't looked at, like inside the television or inside the clock. Like, if we dismantle these things, there could be things inside of them. Were there any numbers in the DVD that we saw of Austin? Like there was, there was, was, no, there was the just end. the DVD at the well, end. No, just the 50 at the end. There was but a I mean, number in the, the actual end. footage. No. No. And there were, did we catch any glimpse of anything painted on the wall when we were watching the DVD? Yeah, when you were watching the DVD, there was, like, plenty of things. There was, like... Like other, like, Masonic symbols, like Illuminati symbols. Okay. Uh, like on walls or on doors or you know sometimes there would be like a whole wall written with like <coughs> numbers all over it um 
But, you know. Nothing. Okay. But it was, yeah, kind of like a, it was cut together sort of like a, sort of flashy. Like, like the best of Austin. Mm -hmm. Like mm -hmm. the best of Austin's actions. So if no one feels like we need any of this equipment again, I would be very happy to rip these things open and see if there's anything in them. But I don't know how things put things back together very well. So I agree for the TV. I think the clock we might want to keep around. Yeah, because we got the DVD and then we needed the TV. So right. We haven't used the clock yet. So, no. you know, if we're going to destroy the TV, it would be a very good stress reliever if anyone feels a little on edge. Would you like to smash a television? Meredith wants to smash the television. Oh, by all means, please. But what is she going to smash it with? Just, just, knock just it over. use your, like, the, you can pick it up. And oh, knock. yeah. <laughs> yeah, so Meredith is like, Fuck you, Kyle! Uh, fuck you! Fuck you, you son of a bitch! Fuck off! And then she's like, <laughs> slush, and then she's like, she's screaming about Kyle. Nice. Who's Kyle? Kyle is my husband. Well, it doesn't sound like that he son of be. a bitch scum fuck cheated on me. <coughs> I'm sorry to hear that. Is that it's your... fine. Don't, don't talk about it. Hey, I I don't want to like open any old wounds, but just on the off chance, he didn't cheat on you with Eliza, did he? I could have. Oh, okay, fucked every right. slut in this state. Mm, fair enough, because that would be like a really cool full circle storytelling thing. <laughs> Wouldn't it be great if that happened? Yeah. Like, Copperfield is bad at these cliche things, but every once in a while, he comes through. Okay. All right, so, now that the television yeah. is fast, is there anything in it? Like, a number, a fortune cookie? <laughs> you open the fortune no. cookie, inside is a smaller fortune cookie. <laughs> <laughs> no, there, there's nothing. nothing. Oh. Mm. Well, I officially... Um, I'm stuck. Yeah, I'm yeah. stuck. Let's, uh... Kill the druggie. No. <laughs> I mean, you, you have the full prerogative to do whatever you guys want to do. I mean, you you managed to get like four numbers. I'm not gonna say that we should kill people, but if we do, there's a killer, and then there's a druggie. I'm gonna try. I'm first of all, I'm gonna Christopher. Can I borrow your key card? Just real oh. quick. Yeah, you can have it. I don't need to carry it around. I'm going to try Christopher's key card. We already did this, though, didn't mm. we? we already tried so Christopher's key ones. card is for number six. Yeah. And it doesn't work in any of the other doors at no, all. Only the only one door. Okay, that's too complicated to go through. Here, I'll get it back. <laughs> no, you can hang on to it. You don't want it? I don't need a key card. As long as one of us has it, it's fine. Okay. They're all just key cards. It would be cooler to have them all in one place and we have to keep it. The cool thing is that after a while... You're not going to be able to tell the difference because they look exactly identical. It would be amazing. That's right. I'll put them in my opposite pockets. <laughs> okay, who's helping me carry the pedestal? Yeah, I'll, I'll do it. Ooh, what, what you going to do? Smash what the that? floors. Oh, no. Are you no. going to use it to crush the drug dealers? Yes. Head? Oh, no. What the? No. We got to get out of here. How do you, you, you have all these weapons, but you decide to crush his head. How, well, they have the They're not going to give me the weapons um, to kill a guy. I don't. Do, we're not going to kill do a guy. Meredith or uh, Clark? Clark well, I anything? am losing my patience Clark's, when he's talking about killing someone. Clark is very skittish every time like the thought of somebody dying. is, you know. But Meredith oh. is pretty chill about it. Meredith actually is kind of like... Not like she wants people to die, but she would understand like the desperate. Look, look, like, I'm, like, I'm not. Look, I'm not trying to rationalize myself down the line. So far, self defense. That's cool. This guy, he's he's gone anyway. I'm not gonna try and think of reasons to come after each and one of you. This is we're at a wall. Really? Because you kind of. This a, makes sense. What happens when we hit the next wall? Look. You're fine. You're a normal guy. That doesn't make me feel better. You can't just keep killing people when we hit Look, blocks. But guess what? You outnumber me. You can stop me anytime. You no, are his arch enemy. That's not going to happen. <clears throat> who's, who's, Look, who's looking after Austin? I, I figured thought, he I mean, would just kind of hang out. Keep that an eye on him. Up, we really weren't paying that much attention. No, we were keeping he's, an eye on him. He's, he's trying to rustle out of his... his uh... Okay, how about we get him instead then? Because he's going to be the more immediate threat. Can we agree on that? Can we How save about, the druggie as a plan C and deal with plan B right here? That is a threat. He's, he's No, 
We're not killing a guy. Look, Lewis, we're not going to kill the guy we, who's we're literally... We're not. He is. We're, we're, we're no, not gonna, you're going to stand by and let him kill somebody? Are you kidding me? It's not that big of a... It's, it's, it's a huge deal. He's killed dozens of people. He said it himself, if, if not us, if not him, then us. It's Austin, Austin, stop. We're turning over to the cops, right? So just chill out and stop. We did give our word. This is taking too long. That's what I say. Yeah. It's it's taking a long time because we're trying to figure this out, all right? Whatever help you can give us can make it go faster. The alternative this Tommy is... guy is crazy. What? Yeah, yeah, the alternative Tommy. is murdering Tommy. people. Okay, sorry. Tommy Bohannon. Tommy. Look, look. I've never tried to do anything. I've just gone same method each time. Yeah, and they keep... Ru- bringing... Ruthless. Kill everyone. Don't think about the consequences. Doesn't matter. None of their lives matter. My life matters. I'm gonna get out of here. Yeah, did and they you keep... start killing from the get go. Yeah. Hmm. What 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 did you do before you were kidnapped the first time? I worked at a radio shack. Oh. <laughs> so you were ready to kill right there. <laughs> While they're talking, Austin, I want to give Tommy the knife. 